we have a smoke detector that's inside of us as well, just like the GPS. The smoke detector in us all is called our amygdala. And it's there to protect us, to alert us to potential danger. So if we were to back thousands of years, a saber-toothed tiger coming toward us, that is danger, perceived danger, and we act accordingly. We either fight if we've got something that we're gonna fight with to, to protect ourselves, or we're gonna run, or maybe we're gonna freeze too, and hope that it doesn't see us. But our amygdala is the same thing. Now, how does it show up? It's gonna try and protect us when we wanna do something that we're uncomfortable doing. Maybe we're going to ask somebody for something in particular that we're nervous about doing that. We're going to start a new business. We're going to take a new class. Uh, we're going to start a new job. We're going to ask somebody out that we're like nervous. Are they going to say yes or no? Those are all things that the smoke detector in our brain, the amygdala is saying, Patrick, don't do that. You're risking looking embarrassed, making a mistake. Play it safe. Don't do that. But just like the smoke detector with burnt food, this isn't a real emergency. It's just trying to protect us. We have the ability to override this, to say, this isn't a real emergency.